We can never like tell. Like you said, this is the best place to pull out a surprise. <laughs> Apparently not, okay? <laughs> yeah, and a, a man go. can drink. <laughs> yes. Or more so hope. <laughs> but, That's true. But here we go. Oh, look at this. Now sticking with his big gun, Shaheen here is Labyrinth and taking it to the Forgotten Realm. Again, this could go either way for both players and characters. We do know that Akuma has tools enough to induce damage in this stage with three breakable floors. Mm -hmm. Yes, and we've seen uh, Labyrinth and uh, Tanisun Torgun dominate their previous matches to get to this spot here. And a lot is on the line because whoever wins this will be uh, scheduling a date with a yeah. Yes, to get to the grand ball, which is the grand final. Definitely. And after that, still the undefeated roadblock in Hempel Mori, right? But right now, let's get to the action. Tanasun Tortun, look at this, being barraged by a very hungry Lavarez here from the Philippines. Very true. Nice heavy Hadouken there. And look at that. The jump mix-ups are coming out. Oh, focus attack. Find his mark. And more than enough to gain a lot of damage here. Oh, he finds the wall. Oh, just a little too close. Oh my goodness. And this is turning out to be quite a momentum uh, to start with for, for Tanasun Torgo. Here we go. Look at him burning that immediately. And waited a few seconds. He knows that the wall is right there. And he doesn't need to take it too far. That we go. Through. And look at that. Still the corner pressure is with Tanasun Torgo. The jump mix ups are coming in. Nice uh, right 3-3. Three, three. But look at that. A dragon uppercut just to alleviate the pressure. And so far, it is all Tanasun Torgo. Oh man, and already broken one floor is Thailand, right? Let's see. Oh, again, a straight uppercut. That is one of the one of the signatures of Lavarez right here. Yeah. He breaks a floor of his own and now taking it a little bit up in terms of damage against Sanasu. Wow, okay, he rides the projectile. Nice pistol squad there. He's got to worry about that. And to jump into the pistol squad. Oh, wow, the Altair for the anti air options of Akuma. A little too far for that screw attack from Lavarez. Has one hit too many. Here we go. Oh, just snipes out the pistol squad with an off here, that hop kick. And he gets himself one round in. Could this be again breathing room for Labyrinth? Just just felt out what Tanasun Torngun is capable of for sure. And now just getting a little chip damage in Tanasun Torngun, trying to find more openings. Had him at back turn, just, just checked him right there. And now they switch sides. Nice brain chop there by Tanasun Torgun, and he's, the jump mix are coming in. Oh boy, and this is going to be huge damage. La Lever is again taking it to the wall, now with no more floors to break. And he is going to capitalize on that as much as he can. There we go. Oh, what wow. a punish. And look at that, the slides are coming out. Oh, Serpent follow-up to gain himself that fourth match. Pico, we have ourselves a game. Oh, and we, and we do with just Pico first game. That okay, so mano in mano right here. No more breakable floors. Despite what you see from those tiles, they are not going anywhere, ladies and gentlemen. Tanasun Torngun now with a slight poke lead against Labyrinth. You're just really uh, imposing his oppression with those jump-in mix-ups. Going for either a slide, a demon flip, or just a dive kick. Let's see how he's going to choose to close out the distance here. Oh, wow. He oh, 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 the combo. Oh, and Lever is seeing that, capitalizing on that drop combo. Of and look at this. It's very it's very usual for Lever to be fancy, but not at this point right now in the tournament and in this event. Oh, and there it is. The Sandstorm just closing match number one for Lever. Okay. So again, a lot of nerves coming into this, into this part of the event. And of course, with being on the lower bracket semifinals right now, not even the, the finals yet. Yes. They have one more, one more roadblock ahead of them. Either way, if these guys move forward, they will face their teammate. That's it's true. a potential to face their teammate. Yes, there's a certain electric in the air because the stakes have been put so high here. Again, second seven, a gold medal event. And we have uh, Hempamorn just sitting there in the finals, just sitting pretty watching. And oh, uh, I believe Tanisun Torgun has gained, gained some words of wisdom from, I believe, his coach. Again, probably, a, a, again, when you're in that uh, position, the lights are so bright, it, it's so intense, you're probably not seeing something that you're supposed to be doing and having someone there to give you words of wisdom, even um, words of comfort can mm -hmm. really help out. Okay, so... Um Safe to say right now that maybe, just maybe, Lavarez has a little bit more confidence in the style that Tanasun Torngun has brought forth. Now, moving into Jungle Outpost, again, folks, there is a breakable wall here, and below it is a, uh, rather, a balcony 
feet first and then below it is a breakable wall. We call it the fans and the beaver dam Round here one. in Jungle Outpost. True, Fun. and at the uh, lower floor, it becomes a huge stage. Almost unreachable by, by half of the cast. Here we go, and Labyrinth sinking into the wall. Here we go, great follow-up. And Tanasun Torngood down by Half-Life already. Then just 10 seconds in. So far, Tanasun Torngood trying to gain some momentum back, but Labyrinth is not allowing it. Nice splat. And one more hit would do it. Nice down forward of the one there. That wow. hit of Labyrinth. Okay, so we know Labyrinth to actually be donning this uh, preset right here. <laughs> he loves this uh, this this outfit of uh, of uh, Shaheen right here. But that really doesn't uh, doesn't matter at all at this point because Tanasu Torku, despite being comboed, just got things back. The damage has all returned to hot Labyrinth. Pika also he does have one stick of butter there on your lower right screen, ladies and gentlemen. You have to worry about that. You're facing an Akuma, and just like that, oh. he drops the combo, though. Was almost there, and again, Tanasun Torngun with his execution is very, very dangerous. Here we go. And Lavarez again with the red stuff. He also can pose the same danger. There's a pistol squat. Wow, nice block on the Ooh. low, and that Altair got punished by Tanasun Torngun. Again, Lavarez does like working with that rage. He can, he loves confirming that rage drive of Shaheen. If you see him trying to shake your hand, don't accept it. <laughs> That's not for you, my good sir. Yes. That is for me. <laughs> <laughs> so, yep. never so, accept it. <laughs> never accept that rage drive of Shaheen. And now Tanasun Torgun trying to even things out in terms of life. And the wake up option there from Lavarez. Excellent stuff. Stopping Tanasun Torgun in his track. Here we go. Look at this. Getting damage. Getting wall carry. And Lavarez almost putting Tanasun Torgun in rage. Oh my goodness. There's the slide. The sandstorm. Two in a row. One more hit. And that will end Tanasun Torgun. Should it be the case. If Lavarez can close this out. Look at that. Making that wall walk block. Oh my oh. goodness. Jumping over him. Using the 2D. Wow. <laughs> mechanics to his advantage. He's jumping over the 2D character and hitting him from behind. Now Tanasun Torgun is no stranger to come back, so let's see. Lavarez cannot take him any lightly. He is in the lead in terms of matches and rounds. Okay, and let's not forget how many axe kicks Lavarez ate earlier. So let's see if he he'd be very careful. Look, it, it's, it seems like it. You know, Lavarez is, is being more comfortable, and you can see it by the look on his face. Mm -hmm. I, I think I'm okay. Yeah, I think yeah. so too. <laughs> quick work out of that uh, last round there. Now Tanasun Torgun just really baffled now. Again, gonna get more words of wisdom because Lavarez was really able to nullify any of the changes he tried to make. Mm -hmm. now, now, again, uh, this is uh, a little bit of a thought process here mm -hmm. for Tanasun Torngun. He, he wants to hear some more details that he may have missed mm -hmm. out of his coach. Now, Lavarez may be slow and steady. He knows that I am I think I'm doing all right, but I'm not out of the woods yet, yes, as you would say. For sure. Uh, I, I still have quite uh, a journey to go to. Another three minutes, maybe, or five at most, Who knows? if I go the distance. Because Tanasun Torngun can change things around. Now, everyone in the home is probably thinking, what should I do? Due to nullify Shaheen's option because Labrez has been so on point with just with punishment as well as getting the conversions on the get-go and Tanasun Torgun I don't know if he has um, just to shake out the nerves because this is the lower bracket semi-finals but yeah he needs to bring out the demon. if that is indeed uh, the mentality he's in or is he gonna play it a little safer this time around because we, we do know that Shaheen he can he can just sniff out flaws in your defense because of his simplicity, just like that, tried to go heavy is a Tanasun Torngun, and he pays for it. Look at this, Labyrinth, and also showboating with a combo yep. that is really signature of. Yep. Pays for it indeed, and wow, finds another uppercut there to launch Tanasun Torngun to the corner. And look at that, tried to grab him, but nice duck on the focus attack. Slides, but was out of range with Tanasun Torngun. Ooh, did you see that? Labyrinth was just in place, just uh, trying to uh, dance his way into taunting Tanasun Torngun into coming close. That's actually a strategy that most players might make, you know, he, he's up on health, yes. and he, he didn't need to do anything heavy. He just wants the opponent to come to him and make that decision. Yeah, and it's a mental game, and also you're trying to make your opponent flinch. You know how in the boxing, how you faint and duck yes. and dive? That's what these players are trying to do. And now look at this, Tanasun Torgun not feeling too happy about that first round, trying to gain things back, but Lauder is just denying him any opportunity of doing that, finds a launch in the process. And again, look at Lavarez just using those hard to do combos for a Shaheen, and you know Shaheen doesn't even need to do that. But this is a uh, this is a, an indication that he is confident with his execution now. Correct indeed. And look at that, Tanasun Torgun finds an axe kick and a wall as well to maximize his combo. Wow. 
Oh, all right, excellent stuff. And no, Scorpion Tail uh, eats it. Uh, Thanosun Targoon eats a lot of damage in this process. Here we go, and great block and punish from Thanosun Targoon. This, this could be it, you know. Uh, I, I guess Lavarez was a little too risky on that one. Uh, the momentum Round might just four. shift because he needs to get this particular win just to stay alive. This does. is his last life. Can't afford to have any more mistakes. And now he does have one stick of butter to use. Some resources are in Thanosun Targoon's side. Nice uh, dragon uppercut there. It bounces him with a Shakunetsu. Bounces him again on the wall. Oh my goodness, the conversions, the awareness as well of Tanasu Torngun is not to be taken lightly. He knows his terrain. He knows his zoning. Here we go. Great block as well on that double Scorpion Tails with, with a down forward one to punish. And Tanasu Torngun ties things up in round. Again, the comeback factor is alive and well in this game. And wow, nice brain chop there from jumping. And look at this. Uh, the balcony is right there, but he is not going to get it because the wall is at, uh, at Lavarus' favor. Oh, look at this. And are we going to see the same exact scenario a while ago? Wow, burning everything off of that meter for that additional special move that Akuma has. And just like that, ladies and gentlemen, Tanasun Torgun gets one on the board. Now it's not looking, um, it's looking really well so far in Tanasun Torgun's uh, part. But let's see if uh, he can continue this momentum that he's established. Because Labrez is still up by one win right now, and he actually gets to choose his terrain and or character. Now, in this, in this particular scenario, we're moving back to Howard Estate. Again, very favorable for Shaheen. He is more than able to, to go from one end to the other while making sure that his combo stays strong. As for Tanasun Torngun, he you will definitely hope as an Akuma that you have meter. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, your combos won't work. Mm -hmm, very true. So, uh, early uh, rounds, one, actually the first the round, Lavarez needs to come out of the gate and uh, it establishes dominance to gain that round before Tanasun Torngun can gain one. any of those resources. Right. Fight. And uh, there he is. Look at him just positioning himself already. He wants that balance. Yes. You can feel it. And look at this. Still at the center of the stage, but right behind Tanatsu Torgun is that um, is that tatami wall. There are three tatami walls in a balcony for like really easy, ladies and gentlemen. So let's see if Lavares would grant us the uh, pleasure, pleasure of touring Howard Estate. But look at this. Great conversion from Lavares. Just taking Tanatsu Torgun towards the wall. Great duck and punish off of that down forward 1-1. One, one. Now let's see if Lavares can make his wish come true right here. Oh, he oh, does it again. <laughs> He's jiving because he wants that wall break. Oh. Absolutely angling himself to where it will be useful. And he is going to carry this to the wall. Yes, definitely. Oh. There we go. Double Scorpion Tails. Breaks the first Tatami wall. Finds it once again. Oh, dashes in for the wild rising 3-3. <laughs> oh. Lavarez, you insane man, you. Oh, but look at this. Tanasun Targoon had a little bit enough of that. Finds the focus attack and introduces himself to the third Tatami wall. Breaks it. Two in my book. Oh, he, he he uses a key charge for a little bit of a setup right there. Maybe trying to get into Lavarez's head, but look at this. That uppercut from the side will get Laver, uh, Lavarez's advantage, and he Whoa. breaks everything. And here we go. We are seeing the Sakuras, ladies and gentlemen. Lavarez up 2 0, but not if Tanasun Sargoon has anything to say about it. Can he make a comeback? Nice 4 1 counter hit there from Lavarez. Fishing for that counter hit, of course. Shaheen is indeed slightly faster than Akuma is. There we go. Great punish from Tanasun Sargoon. Oh. So Lavarez having broken three of the four terrains of this. Oh my goodness, this could be really, really painful. And yes. Tanasun Torgun with the right carry will take this to the wall and he does. Oh my goodness, one meter in hand still. Lots of damage. And my goodness, Lavarez does not have the life to his advantage now. Look at this oh. and just the mid. Tanasun Torgun is still alive and well in this match. And don't look now, Fosh, but the meter is building up right now for Tanasun Torgun. Shoot that throb and electrify itself. So, then Lavarez will have a problem, but right now it's Sanasun Torngun who is being moved towards the wall. Excellent duck from that focus attack, and Lavarez capitalizing on the open. Sanasun Torngun, and look at that, he spends the meter because he knows another one's being built. And now Tanasun Torngun figuratively is back is against the wall. He needs to make the right reads here. Oh my goodness, here we go again, trying to fish for those straight uppercuts. The Shaheed Godfish, as we call it here in the Philippines. Oh my goodness, and Lavarez, look at this, wiggling out of the wall, and it tries to take the, the fight back center stage. Yep. 25 seconds left. So far, life advantage is with Lavarez. He can afford to burn out the time, but Tanasun Torgun is trying to juke and jive. Oh, no! Punish there! It was a little out of range for that Wild Rising uh, Hawk Edge. And now Tanasun Torgun ah! finds himself <laughs> in a big launch. And just like that, Lavarez secures his uh, ticket to move 